No intro, I'm lazy today, I don't want to do an intro <laughs> As if my intro are memorable <laughs> Party mode today, party fragrance where I use from my collection uh, when I'm going bulgy Let's go Oh, I'm in it's not possible Putain. I'm not in the mood I don't know what's happening to me Oh putain, calm down, calm down, calm down. Everything is fine, you're doing a video, you're talking about fragrance. The first thing I would do personally before, especially for winter holidays, especially when I have this part over here out or just my arms, I put a lot of glitter. Voilà. Why is it not straight now? Oh my god, no. It... Number five, body gel. A limited edition, it smells like number five. When I apply that before, my fragrance tend to last longer. I don't know if you're gonna see anything of that, but I'll show you, look. Yeah, and it's very fresh, so apply it when you're not frozen to death, otherwise it's, it's just not really great, isn't it? Can we see the sparkling? Ah. Like this. Like very um, champagne, like very fizzy. What is this hair? Why, why are you... Ah! And then after that, usually I stay in the Chanel mode and I get, you might say, oh, number five on top of number five. No, I love the Chance uh, classic because it's got a lot of pink pepper and a little bit more of a joyful Fun. I usually like to have the classic on top because it's more full of pink pepper than the other ones and it just gives something classy but also like I'm gonna go dancing. You see the vibe? That's the vibe. Voila! This one has been my friend, my friend since many years, Rolling in Love by Kilian. I will absolutely not show you close up of my Kilian's uh, because uh, they are absolutely destroyed and you might be like, oh, this is not very a good bottle then. No, no, it's just me. I've put them into the sea, so it's a great memory though. <laughs> Give something extremely sensual and sexy without being tacky. Show sure that everyone's gonna smell me because it smells super creamy, super rich. And you might find it quite discreet on YouTube, but I can assure you that everybody smells you. I get always complimented when I wear this one. Almondi tuberose like fragrance. Tuberose is a very white, creamy uh, flower emphasized by the cloudy aspect. Uh, with the musky uh, vibe around it. It's just gorgeous. This one is a black phantom. Okay, let's go to the mask. Oh, that's a, that's a vibe. Black Phantom by Killian. So a bit the masculine version in the Killian mode. I just feel the Killians are just amazing fragrance to go party because they always have that cocktail aspect to them. Provocative, sexy. You're going to the party. You're going for the extravaganza. And Black Phantom is one of them. It's one of the most gourmand, coffee-like fragrance you will ever smell. Plus some rum in there, so it's sexy. So rich, it's a thick fragrance, like it gives a charisma. Please, if you're wearing a fragrance like that, behave. Behave. <laughs> Don't kill the charm of this fragrance. <laughs> So you know like when I'm when I'm going partying I like to do combo because I want to be head to toes fragrance and I want to make sure that everyone will remember the, the time when I enter the room. Je Voy and it's Fire at Will, one of the most beautiful and opulent vanilla fragrance you will ever smell. It is so fluffy, gourmand, cloudy. When you have a vanilla sponge cake, like it feels like this to me. And usually I pair it with a nude fragrance that I would put on the pulse point. This one is Irish, it's called Houdini. It's a very strong, strong like wood, but it doesn't smell too animalic. It's also balanced with vanilla. So it's just to give to the gourmand sweetness a little bit of a dark mode to attack and pulse all night. My next combo is from a... It's from nowhere. I don't, I don't know what's happening today. I, I just can't... I just can't put my mind into the video. It's just weird. 
L'Occitane en Provence and it's Terre de Lumière. It's been very long I didn't talk about this fragrance actually but God how much I love this. First of all this is the, the golden edition so it already gives you the party mode but there's a lot of pink pepper in this fragrance and I feel those kind of pink pepper smell are more effervescent and give something extremely fun to the fragrance when bubbling you know the sweet and honey lavender combo. Honey lavender directly make me think of a surge of personally. This is a bomb. If you love honeyed touch with aromatic vibe, you're gonna love that. So beautiful and underrated. L'Occitane en Provence, you should try it, guys. If you're more masculine, you've got l'eau des beaux from L'Occitane en Provence. It's just one of my favorite masculine fragrances at this point. It's beautiful. Usually when I spray this fragrance, I like to add this oil uh, from a Tom Ford shimmer or smaller than in the number five gel. Soleil Blanc it's a little bit tropical coconutty and I think it gives something a little bit more creamier exotic to l'Occita en Provence which is great most luxurious gumbo <laughs> first step is on the pulse point I will apply my oil so this one is from Sensalim and it's called Jet I have to say Jet has been one of my go-to for parting because the scent is super intense I don't even know how to describe it You've got something a little bit exotic, fruity, a bit like Tom Cabin La Vanilla, like, oh, no! Oh my God, I'm keep destroying things, Jesus. Then after that, I will apply one of my most luxurious films, which is Cabot from Fragrance du Bois. A lot of animalic vibe and also spices, like this cinnamon. But it's also quite sweet, but at the same time, you hear the depth of the fragrance. You, when you smell it, it definitely smells super luxurious. Floral heart that is super super blossoming on the skin, the rose is incredible, look luxurious and it smells luxury. And then, because it's not done, and my feet sillage, you know when you dance, you move the hair, so for me, you don't go party without your hair fragrance. My favorite at the moment is a hair perfume from Ella K, it's Lettre de Pushkar, so it's a very sweet touch florally, but it gives something, uh, to be fair, like oriental vibe in there. So I love to spray that on my hair quite a lot. And then definitely it intensifies the sillage. And when I dance, I can smell it. <laughs> Such a beautiful fragrance. So, ah! Fuck. It's started to look at it like Christmas. Oh, I'm losing it. Let's finish this video, you know what? The next one for the party mood that I like to... Miri Camus by Mila Harris. Uh, this is the new baby uh, from Mila Harris. Red fruit going on, that is beautiful. Overall, it smells like a fruity floral greenness to it, I have to say. Um, so it feels a bit candid. It feels that the one that I want to party, but it's like, mm, you know, like she likes a nice, cute cocktail dress. She doesn't want to feel sexy. She just want to feel like blossoming, like a cherry blossom in the spring what what it smells extremely extremely natural so you get something beautifully fragranced natural it's like a fresh bouquet of flower elegance it falls to the party a fun vibe oh you shake that uh, tell me in the comments uh, which are the fragrances you use for party. Uh, I've got quite a lot, but I wanted to show you, especially on this video, my favorite combo at the moment. Uh, yeah, and I wanted to talk as well, uh, but I'm, I'm I didn't receive it yet, so I can't do that now. But I'm gonna receive the new Kayali, and I have to say, with the advertisement and the way she's talking about the fragrance, it sounds absolutely insane for a little bit of a luxurious bougie thing. Anyway, I'll keep you updated on this one. I want to thank you, uh, all my UTIPers, for sending little super thanks as well. And UTIP, it's really appreciated. Uh, yeah, I have a lot of things to do today and I'm, I feel my clumsiness is at its peak today. So it's gonna be a challenge, I feel, but uh, let's see. Okay, I wish you a lovely day. Bye now.
paradis bleu.